And when you receive the spirit of the word or spirit of Christ inside of you, that spirit should bear witness with your spirit if you are a child of God. You should settle that because why? You're not looking for anything else that would validate you because the scripture validates you that you are a child of God when you receive Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior. That spirit in you, that's enough to say you should not question whether you're in God or not in God because the scripture says this is the fight of faith now. Because if you're not careful, the enemy will make you feel like you're not in God. Make you feel like you're not safe. Or you still have issues you're still working through. It, listen, that's not going to move you out of Christ because when we receive Christ, how many know he's inside of us? He doesn't jump inside of us because you had a bad day or because you cursed or because you did something wrong. That's your emotions. The word never changes. So therefore, we have to wrap hold of the word and say, I know that even though I'm a child of God, key point, child, child means I'm not mature. It means I'm immature in some things, but that doesn't validate my what sonship or my child being in Christ. What validates me is what the word says I am, and I agree with it. That's the fight of faith that we're talking about. You have to hold on to that because most people today, amen, they're jumping around inside of God because why? They're established based upon their circumstances and their feelings, and it has nothing to do with faith. How I many know we need to stand in faith concerning God's word? Amen. 